Hey, what's up? It's the Nomad Brad, and I want to show you a really cool tool, my favorite new keyword research tool in 2018. I'm going to show you uh, how you can use it if you're using Bing ads, if you're using AdWords, if you're using Amazon, if you're doing SEO, if you're doing affiliate marketing. Uh, it's a really great tool to have access to, and I'll just show you how it works. All right, so the tool is called Keywords Everywhere, and it's free. It's really amazing. So I wanted to show you this. Uh, keyword research is really important if you're doing any kind of paid advertisement or SEO, like organic marketing, if you're doing YouTube videos. It's really important to have your mind wrapped around how keywords work, and it, the best way to do it is just to keep seeing you know, just keep trying things, keep looking, because you might have ideas in your head for what people might be searching for, and it will be completely different in reality. This happens all the time. So it helps to constantly be bombarding yourself with keyword data because your brain is going to start to like see patterns and figure out, you know, um, what's going on there. So this, that's why I really, really love this tool. I think it's a different way to approach keyword research than just like going to a tool and typing in the thing that you want. Um, this, the way that this works is it's, it's called keywords everywhere. So basically while you're browsing around the web doing your normal things, there's keyword data mixed in. And if you're a marketing nerd or if you're not yet, you probably will be soon. Um, it's really awesome to see just how people are searching for things, how it relates to what you're looking for. And you can also use it proactively to go do research and figure out how to attack a niche. If you're doing organic traffic, finding keywords that are like low hanging fruit, uh, low competition. If you're doing paid traffic, figuring out how do people phrase the searches that pertain to the niche that you're targeting, um, which you know niches within the niche are bigger or get more traffic. So let's show you how it works here. Uh, this thing, basically it's a Chrome plugin. So you add, I'll show you how to um, install it where you can get it in a second, but it starts to show keywords in all different places while you're searching around. Again, that's why it's called Keywords Everywhere. So the first thing, it adds all these little overlays to your normal searches. So here's one, I searched for weight loss in, I just went to Google and searched for weight loss. First off, this is added by Keywords Everywhere. Um, it shows you the keyword, the volume of the search per month. For this keyword, uh, it shows you the average you know, cost per click for, for um, people bidding on the keywords here. And they use a competition metric. I can't really vouch for the competition metric. I don't know, it's probably just as good as all the other ones. Um, but also really cool over here, it starts to give you people also search for. So you might be familiar with the uh, concept of looking down here from Google to see other similarly phrased search phrases. That's kind of been part of the keyword game for a while. But this actually adds, again, you see they added another overlay. They, they just kind of analyze where we're looking when we're looking for keyword research and they just add a little thing to make it easier for you. Basically take all the work out of it for you. You don't have to think about it and try to guess. You can just see exactly what the trends are, what the patterns are. So down here, they offer another little um, overlay so you can see, you know, Google will show you as a user which things are similar, but this actually shows you, you know, how those keywords are performing. Um, so that's that's one thing here. This overlay is really amazing. I mean, look at look at this. Like you, you type in one thing and it gives you all these alternative, different ways, longer, um, longer tail keywords to search for. And, you know, just so you're not wasting your time on a bunch of long tail keywords that don't really get any searches, you can see um, long tail keywords and on average, you know, how many searches they get. This is truly incredible. This is just really amazing while you're browsing around. Here's another thing too. Um, when you type in a keyword, anytime you're doing searches, it will also add an overlay to the search bar. So once again, it's just constantly bombarding your mind with, you know, keywords. This is going to make you better and better as a marketer. It'll make every move that you make more targeted and closer to victory every single time you internalize all this data. Um, here, let's do another search. So I just did a Bing ads tutorial. Once again, you know, there's uh, 
as you're searching, it will give you a bunch of different keywords and how many searches per month they get, um, you know, how valuable the keyword is and how competitive they are. It's really amazing. Here's the same overlay over here. Really great for long term, uh, long tail keywords to pick up. If you're doing YouTube videos, these are awesome. You can just, you know, make a YouTube video that specifically targets each of these things. If you're doing ads, if you're setting up uh, ad campaigns within Bing ads or in AdWords, these are all great exact match or phrase match um, keywords to add to your campaign. Same thing over here. You can see, um, you know, which which terms you should place your priority on. Um, it also, the keyword, the tool seems to be affiliated with a deeper research uh, site called Keyword Keg. I haven't really used them yet. Um, I haven't really utilized this. I have other tools like uh, Longtail Pro and SEM Rush and uh, other tools that I've used for this functionality of going deeper with keywords, but you can always um, you get like a basic sampling for free and then I think you have to uh, pay for the more advanced data. So it'll give you a little sampling here. This is pretty typical. This is this is pretty normal for keyword tools. Uh, most of them have a similar setup. But what's not typical is all of this. All of this like stuff that's constantly showing while you're going about your business. This, this is going to be really great for ideas. You can literally just like proactively find... Um, long tail keywords to make videos about or to make exact match keywords or phrase match keywords to add to your campaign. Really awesome. Uh, here's just another one, another example of using Google. Um, you know, lots of different cool uh, video ideas here. So this is this is the tool. It's called Keywords Everywhere. You can go to keywordseverywhere.com and download it. It's a plugin for both Chrome and Firefox. So if you use one of those browsers, you can just you know click install, and it's really easy to set up, just like any other Chrome plugin. Just click install, click add. I've already got it added. So, and then there'll be there'll be one more step where you have to add an API key. They walk you through it. It's very very simple. Uh, basically, they just give you a unique code that you can um, that you need to use to prove that you've signed up. So the other thing that's really, really cool about Keywords Everywhere, again, going with the everywhere theme, is that it's not just, it doesn't just overlay things in Google AdWord or Google, the search engine. As you can see here, they have a long list of places where they do keyword research and they show you keyword data. So Google search, those are the ones that we've looked at in the last few minutes here. But they also do Google Trends, eBay, Answer the Public. If you don't know what that is, I'll show you in a second. It's amazing. Uh, Google Keyword Planner. So when you're doing more in-depth keyword research. Bing, if you just go to the Bing search engine, I'll show you that in a second. Etsy, if you're doing any sort of uh, e-commerce stuff or whatever, if you're selling on Etsy. I don't know what Suval is. Google Search Console, so if you're doing SEO stuff. YouTube, really, really awesome for coming up with ideas for making YouTube videos um, and also just researching competitors, etc. Um, Uber Suggest, that's another keyword tool. Haven't really used that. I think, well, I'll, I'll show you some of these examples. Majestic, Google Analytics, Amazon, that's another big one. If you're doing uh, Amazon, FBA, e-commerce stuff, this is really, really cool. Keyword shitter, um, I have used that actually. I forget what it does, but it's cool. And most. Okay. So those are the places you can use keywords everywhere. Again, it's free. It's awesome. They have training. So let me show you just a few examples. If you're using Google Trends, um, I just put in Google AdWords here. If you don't know about Google Trends, again, a really amazing tool. It shows you, you know, when search terms are trending. So you can really learn a lot about different niches. Uh, where the people that are interested in them are and it's constantly being updated and it's by Google who obviously knows everything about everyone. But the keywords everywhere addition to Google Trends is down here. So you can see um, what Google Trends does naturally is when you put in a keyword, it gives you some related queries so and related topics. Uh, so here are some related queries. So if, if people are searching for Google AdWords, Google Trends tells you, well, they're very likely to be searching for Facebook Ads Manager or Google AdWords Express Login or Google AdWords Academy. And then 
this little part down here no that that all comes with google trends this little part down here comes from keywords everywhere where they add another little overlay so awesome where they give you search volume for this particular uh keyword they give you competitive uh com competition metric and a average cost per click to see like how valuable that term is so the people bidding on facebook ads manager they're probably like big budget marketing agencies or their even consultants etc so they're paying top dollar for that thing for that keyword um so and you can keep going you can keep looking down the list of related queries to look for you know what you're looking for so if you're um yeah so really awesome there so let's check out another place where keywords everywhere works which is youtube again you can tell here we've got a little Keywords everywhere overlay. I'm just using the, the search phrase click funnels. And you can see here, while you're searching on YouTube, it will give you keyword data. So it's gonna give you, again, which terms that are closely related and how much those terms get searched and how valuable they are and how competitive they are. And it'll do the same thing for the things that you're researching there. Amazon, same deal. If you, you see, I just typed in camping and Amazon, and we got a whole list of suggestions from Amazon, right? So the part on the left is what Amazon gives you. The part on the right is the keywords everywhere edition overlay. So it's showing you, you know, which of these terms is most popular, which one's most expensive to bid on. Um, you can just see the possibilities with this are so, so awesome. Here's the Bing, just bing.com uh, search. You can use this to research your niche. Obviously, same thing when you're searching for things. Keywords everywhere will give you um, search tools. Same down here when Bing, uh, just like Google, when they recommend other search terms, um, keywords everywhere gives you that. Same on Etsy. I mean, you're starting to you're starting to see the pattern here. It's just good to know like what all the all the ways that you can use this tool are. So on Etsy, it gives you search volume, um, cost per click, cost. When you're using the AdWords keyword tool to do deeper um, keyword research, then um, Keywords Everywhere adds overlays here with their own volume which you can gauge against the average monthly volume that Google gives you and their own cost per click, which you can gauge against Google's. Um, and then this is answer the public. So if you don't know about this tool, I'll probably make more videos in the, in the future. It's really, really cool. Um, you just put in one search phrase. So new search. And I just went to, I just searched for click funnels. Basically it, <clears throat> comes up with like every search phrase that people ask about with in relation to that keyword or that search term. Um, it's taking a little second to load here. But in the meantime, I think that's that's the last one I was going to show you. So it is doing a lot. So it does take a couple seconds so you can see how this can benefit you already I mean this is really is my favorite keyword research tool it's different than the tools where you go to the platform and you type in the keywords and you see all the different keywords listed um, for those I like to use like Longtail Pro or the Google AdWords keywords planner or the Bing Ads keywords planner those are really great for that oh um, maybe I can get back. Hmm. There we go. All right. So you put in a keyword and basically answer the public will give you all these different sentences that people search for. So with click funnels, there's are, where, will, what, and it fills in how people complete those sentences. So click funnels, how? How to use ClickFunnels for affiliate marketing. How to integrate ClickFunnels with Shopify. How to use ClickFunnels to, to make money. So th these are already really good ideas for creating articles or YouTube videos. 
um, to get like organic traffic. And I'll show you where keywords everywhere comes in. Maybe. <laughs> uh, yeah, I should have just stuck with the original there. Well, yeah, I'm not sure if you're going to be able to see the answer the public example. But definitely add uh, keywords everywhere to your toolkit. And if you are new to keyword research and you want to get a good foundation in it, learn how to do it, just get like step-by-step -step instruction on how to do it, then I actually have a link below this video to a free keyword research training. So go ahead and click on the link below this video if you wanna learn how to do keyword research like a pro uh, with really simple instruction, step-by-step -step, show you over the shoulder. So if you're overwhelmed by all this keyword stuff and you wanna get started uh, with some free training, I have a link below the video for that. Otherwise, go forth and utilize keywords everywhere to make lots more money by becoming a badass marketer. All right, thanks for watching. I'm the Nomad Brad, and if you like videos like this, teaching you how to become a better marketer and make more money online and live the lifestyle that you want, then go ahead and like and subscribe. Hit the notification bell. I would really appreciate that. And I will talk to you later.